Welcome to Monday Meditation on Psalm 119. I thought you might enjoy a little bit of our Colorado winter today. The verse we're looking at is verse 69. I really titled it Facing Opposition. The psalmist says, the arrogant have forged a lie against me. And then he continues by saying, with all my heart, I will observe your precepts. Now, one of the common challenges we have as believers is when we face hard times, uh, opposition, in this case for the psalmist, people who just hated him and were constantly trying to destroy him, and, and they would go at whatever lengths they needed to for that purpose. But when we go through hard times, we tend to spend so much of our mental energy thinking about the hard times playing it over and over and over again in our minds, wasting countless hours. And the psalmist reminds us that, listen, when we're facing those difficult circumstances of life, even opposition, even people who hate us, rather than wasting our time thinking over and over about our circumstances, we need to be very diligent in thinking about God's word, that is, observe it. And the idea is not only are we paying attention to what it says, but we're thinking seriously about how to apply it. So rather than wasting our time, we are busy continuing to learn about God, learn about his words, thinking about how we can use our circumstances for his glory, making sure that we're walking in a manner that pleases him. So instead of wasting countless hours thinking about things we can't change, we spend our time really meditating on God's word with the objective of living out his word in the midst of our circumstances. So no doubt many of you that listen to this video, you're facing some hard times. Might not be the opposition from the enemy, may just be the normal circumstances of life. Let me just remind you, in the midst of your circumstances, uh, make sure you keep your focus right. In fact, the Apostle Paul said it well when he said, my circumstances have turned out for the greater progress of the gospel. I hope that will be your truth as well. Have a great week in the Lord. Thank you.